This guide shows you how to set the start page and the home page in the new version of Microsoft Edge as of 2020. So it's this version just here, the multicolored Microsoft Edge, as opposed to the, the blue plain Edge there. So all you do is you just go into the new version of Edge. And then once it's loaded, go up to the three horizontal dots in the top right hand corner of the screen. Or if you don't have these or you can't see them, hold down the ALT key and press the letter F for Freddy. Then let go of the ALT key. Then you should have this menu up here. Move your mouse down to settings and left click once. Then on the left hand side, move your mouse over appearance and again left click once. Now you'll see here show home button. So as standard, it's turned off. So if we just turn it on just by clicking on the little dot just there, and there you go, that's turned on. And now it asks us, what do we want to do? Do we want to set a new tab page or do we want to set a certain page? So if you want, if you're happy to have the new tab page come up, which is uh, this page just here, then you can just leave that be. That's when you click on the home button there, incidentally. Or if you'd rather have something like Google come up, then you can click on the little circle just below new tab page and then type in this address here and Google will come up. If you want a different page to come up then all you've got to do is just type in the web page's address. So say for instance I wanted Yahoo to come up. Let's delete out that and you type in that https colon forward slash forward slash www.yahoo.com OK, and that would bring up yahoo.com whenever we click the home button. So if I just give that a test there, let's just open up a new tab and click on the home button just up here. And hopefully Yahoo should come up. And there we go. Yes, Yahoo does come up after we've agreed to the consent on there. If you wanted MSN to come up, then you can just type in that HTTPS colon forward slash forward slash www msn.com and then uh, let's just give that a try so I'm going to open up a new tab and click on the home button just up there and as you'll see now there you go msn is loading so I'm going to set mine though to google so I'm just going to delete out that and type in that https forward slash forward slash www.google.co.uk and let's just give it a test so I'm going to open up a new tab at the top there press the home button and there we go Google loads now if you wanted to set the page that comes up when you first start edge then move your mouse over on startup just there left click once okay and all we, what we need to do is we need to click so that the little black circle is like mine next to open a specific page or pages okay once we've done that click on add a new page so and then it asks us for the address of the page that we want to open when we uh, start Edge. So I'm just going to type in there HTTPS colon forward slash forward slash www.google.com because I want Google coming up. Then I left click add. OK. And then I close out of Edge by clicking on the cross in the top right hand corner and then open Edge again. And hopefully this time it should open. There we go with Google. Now, if I wanted to change it to uh, something like MSN, then uh, I'd just do the same thing. So go to uh, the three horizontal dots and then settings and then up to on startup. And uh, I'm just going to click that the three lines there and go edit because I want to change this. So just type in there HTTPS colon forward slash forward slash www.msn.com and then save. And then if we close down and reopen back up again, hopefully we should see there, there you go, it opens up with MSN. If I wanted Yahoo, let's, uh, let's do that again. So click on the three horizontal dots, click on settings. On the left hand side there, click on startup. And I'm just gonna edit this. So I'm gonna click on the three lines there, then click edit. And I'm going to change that to Yahoo. So HTTPS colon forward slash forward slash yahoo.com or in actual fact 
www.yahoo.com then click save okay and we're just going to close out of this and go back into edge and hopefully yahoo should be our main page and there we go yahoo has loaded up so i'm going to set mine back though to uh, to yahoo I, sorry to google i like google because it does load pretty quick i mean it's not everybody's cup of tea but um like i say i'm going to set mine to google so let's just do that google.co.uk because i'm in the uk okay let's just give that a try so i'm going to close out of that go back into it and hopefully google should load and now also google should load if i click on the uh, the home button just up there there you go so i'm just going to give that a bit more of a test so i'm just going to go into yahoo say so let's search for yahoo go into yahoo's website and there we go and now i'm going to click on the home button and this should take us back to google and there we go yeah it takes us back to google so there you go that guide showed you how to set Google or another search engine as your home button and also your startup page in the 2020 version of Microsoft Edge. Hope this guide helps and thanks for watching. You can follow me on Twitter at CWTech. That's at CWTech on Twitter. And don't forget to check out my other videos in my YouTube channel. Just Google Chris Waite YouTube. And don't forget to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you for your support.